Hello, um, Aaron here from Off on a Whim. And uh, one of my challenges this year is to try and do more videos for my page because apparently that's the big thing that everyone's trying to do. And um, somebody's just like, you gotta get over yourself and just try it. So here I am trying it. And if I can keep up with it, you might see me around a little bit more. Um, so I thought that today I would tell you about one of my very most favorite stones, which I don't think you can even guess because I have so many favorite stones. But this stone is this blue stone. And this is called, if you haven't guessed it already, a Laramar. So Laramars come from the Dominican Republic. It's the only place in the world that you can find them. And they were first discovered in the early 1900s by a priest and he wanted to mine them out of the Dominican Republic but the Dominican Republic said nope sorry no can do I don't know why anyway uh, they were rediscovered in 1974 by another guy I can't remember what he did but he um got I guess he got permission to mine them and uh, that's when the Laramars started coming out onto the market and let me just switch this around so you can see my collection hmm I don't even know how to switch my thing around okay, rather than turning it upside down I just stopped and I'm starting over so here let me show you some of the Laramars I have in my collection it's a rare stone and they can be really pricey I managed to get some while they were on sale at different places and they weren't too 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 expensive compared to how much they usually cost so Laramar is called the dolphin stone you can see why and um the cover name is meant to represent the caribbean or the caribbean i never know how to say that i guess it's the pirates of the caribbean okay caribbean i'll go with caribbean and um like I said, they're only found in one place on earth. The bluer, the more intensely blue the stone is, like this one is the higher quality, higher value. And then if you find them with more green or with brown in them, like this one, that's the um, lower grade stone. My favorites have white veins in it like this and kind of is like the, be looking at the ocean or looking at the sky. That's my favorite one. Um, so let me tell you a little bit about the metaphysical properties. So I told you it's called the dolphin stone. Um, it's meant to assist emotional expression and teach you about love, teach you to love and respect life and the people around you and instill feelings of respect. Uh, it's a good gift for new mothers. It's supposed to aid them with depression and stress. Stress is something all new mothers go through. Depression, not all new mothers go through depression, but it is something we face when we have new babies. And um, yeah, that's about all I have about Laramar for you today. Oh, it can fade in color if it's exposed to heat for too long. I guess that would be high heat, you know. Normal, regular heat would be fine, but sunlight can also uh, destroy the color, especially of the really blue ones. They're photosensitive. So be careful if you have a Laramar piece not to expose it too long to sunlight or get it too close to any flames. It might change the color. That would be sad. So that is all for you today. And please bear with me as I navigate the world of video. Talk to you later.